now we are discussing temperature coefficient of resistance already we have discussed about this when we are studying the six band resistor in the six band resistor starting five bands starting three bands are well, first digit second digit and third digit fourth digit is multiplier fourth color band is multiplier fifth color band is tolerant and the sixth color band is uh, in the six band resistor we are using the sixth color band to indicate the temperature coefficient of resistance in the specifications also we mentioned the resistance value also it is being changed with respect to the temperature now what is this temperature coefficient of resistance temperature coefficient of resistance tells the change in the resistance value of this material with respect to the temperature if i increase the temperature how much resistance is increased or decreased that can be given by using the temperature coefficient of resistance similarly if i decrease the temperature what is the variation of resistance so temperature coefficient is simply giving the variation in this material the variation of the resistance with respect to the temperature generally we denote the temperature coefficient of resistance by using the alpha naught this alpha naught may be positive or negative depending upon the materials we take that we will discuss later okay if we write a mathematical equation it is the ratio of change in resistance to the product of initial resistance and rise in temperature assume that at 0 degree centigrade a material has its resistance r naught what is the resistance of the material at 0 degree centigrade r naught now i am changing the temperature of the material from 0 to t what is the temperature now final temperature t, t. so rise in temperature is t minus 0 when we have increased to the temperature t then the resistance is increased to rt sir so why resistance is increased to rt the resistance may also decrease at the moment we are taking that for that particular material the resistance is, is being increased from r naught to rt so the final resistance is rt at a particular temperature t the resistance is rt now the temperature coefficient of resistance alpha naught is the ratio of change in resistance what is the final resistance rt initial resistance r naught so change in resistance is rt minus r naught ratio of product of initial resistance and temperature this temperature is not final temperature it is the rising temperature if i change example i am changing from t1 to t2 at the t1 the resistance is r1 assume then alpha naught is equal to final resistance rt minus r1 by r naught here r1 into t2 minus t1 this gives the temperature coefficient of a material that material temperature coefficient does not change for every material the temperature coefficient value is fixed so this temperature coefficient tells how the materials resistance is being affected with respect to the temperature so every material temperature varies whether in summer it exhibits some resistance in winter it exhibits some resistance the benches you are sitting the iron benches they exhibit they do not exhibit same amount of resistance in summer and winter about that we will discuss later